Hi everyone, this is Core with MiniesGallery.com. This is a quick look at the latest installment of the Dungeons & Dragons Icons of the Realms Adventure in a Box line of pre-painted miniature products made by WizKids. The Mind Flayer Voyage set was released on August 23rd of 2023 and includes a variety of pre-painted miniatures, accessories, and four fold-out cardboard tiles depicting the four levels of a nautiloid spelljammer ship. The back of each deck level has the name printed on it. The cardboard is pretty thick and rigid, and I like that each section folds up rather than having each level comprised of separate tiles. There are a total of four intellect devourers that come with this set, and they are comprised of two different sculpts for which you receive two minis of each. These are some pretty small miniatures, so there was not much to paint, but two colors were used to paint these, in addition to using black paint for their claws. The brain crenulation details on the sculpt are fairly prominent, and well accented with the use of a dark wash. For such a small mini, I think the sculpts and paint applications of these miniatures are pretty good. There are two mind flayers that come in the set, and each is a different sculpt. I really like the sculpt of this first mind flayer, and I think the paint application is pretty good, and I do appreciate that they used a dark wash on both of these to help bring out the mini sculpted details. I am quite impressed that they still stamped on the eyes of these minis, even though their eyes are so tiny that I only noticed them when I zoomed in and viewed these minis on the video I captured. I think the second mini has a nice Darth Vader-like force grip choke pose. There are two Ceramorphosis pods included in this set, which are the same sculpt and paint application, and they appear to have a Githyanki encased within. The spawning pool has an uneven, translucent top, which helps to give the pool a bit of a murky look to it. This spell jamming helm has some nice detailing, which was well accented by using two tones of vibrant blue paint and then giving it a dark wash. There are a lot of nicely sculpted details on this Ulitharid mini. However, this is not the first time we have seen this sculpt. This is a repainted version of the Ulitharid mini, which was included in the Spelljammer Adventures in Wild Space set. The Mind Witness is also a miniature we have previously seen as a pre-painted mini. This also appears to be the same paint application as was applied to the Mind Witness, which was included in the Boneyard set. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please like this video if you found it helpful, and please be sure to subscribe to see more of my quick reviews.